Hey, hey, ho, ho, welcome back. We are in an Icon Bronco today. This is BR number 67. As you'll notice the last FJ we did was in the Audi Nardo Gray, which is a really good one. Well, this Bronco is in the BMW Ionic Silver, which is another one of those really kind of nifty, smoky grays. I don't think I could pick a favorite between those two colors, but that kind of smoky theme uh, in these modern gray metallics is uh, really interesting to me. And I think it came out really good, especially with the new school editions because of all the black trim bits and highlights. It just pops, makes it look really nice. So let's get into the details of numero 67. New school edition as mentioned, so that has the Icon bumper system. The front hides a worn 9.5 wench with a synthetic rope and Viking Haas Fairlead. The ARB and Viking recovery gear package bag is included. This truck also has the integrated LED lights in that front bumper, as well as the reverse light integrated on the rear license plate assembly. We're running the reverse camera in this rear bumper, and we are running the higher end of the audio packages. The Pioneer NEX 8200, the newest version, which has the tethered and wireless CarPlay connectivity, which is a really nice convenience. We're also running the Focal K2 speakers with separates and crossovers, along with the full amp and bass package. Uh, we're running no Ranger trim on this one. We are running the 3M tinted glass. We're running the Alcantara charcoal headliner, the Icon Lear Jets by Rosen, sun visors that is. We're running the sport pedals. We're running our new center console design, the rear view mirrors, door handles, and front fender badges on this truck. We're trying out an aluminum instead of stainless to shave off a little bit of weight. In this truck's case, the client requested that we black out the front grille and the rear tailgate insert. So these have that volcanic black icon powder coat finish on them instead of the usual silver anodized aluminum. For seating, we're running the Chilowich textiles with the optional three-stage carbon fiber heat blanket underneath the textile. In the rear, we're running the usual tuck and tumble and removable rear two-passenger bench. We have three-point seat belts for everybody. And we obviously have our roll cage with the integrated LED lights, the laser cut stainless steel and aluminum trim surround door panels. For the doors and windows, we're running power door locks. We're also running power windows. This is the power window system that is the new normal for Icon, where it keeps the old school analog control and you simply nudge down for down and up for up, or you double nudge both and everybody goes down. And double nudge both and everybody goes up and is super convenient. What else? I think that's pretty much it. There's nothing freaky deaky or one-off unique to this truck. And I think that kind of uh, gives you a good idea of what we're up to. It is smoking, blistering, nasty hot here in LA today. It's probably a charming 104. So as long as uh, the cameraman and the drone do not melt, uh, it's beautifully clear out if you didn't know we were melting. So uh, hopefully you get to enjoy all that lovely footage. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your interest. I hope you are healthy and well, and we will see you on the next one.